Much against the upper crust wishes of his mother, the self-conscious 11-year-old Chris became a country music convert. Fell in love with Hank Williams and uh, started playing the guitar. My aunt told a story where he did a recital as a kid with his back to the audience, <laughs> you know, because he was so shy. By the time he entered San Mateo High School in 1950, Chris had matured into a handsome all-American boy. A straight-A student, star athlete, and very popular with the opposite sex, he'd also discovered a love for words and songwriting. Story writing kind of started out with a teacher that I had in uh, high school. You know, she assigned us, she said, write an original story, and I didn't even know what original meant. I said, oh, well, can, can I make it up, or <laughs> does it have to be true, or something like that? Chris's literary skills flowered at Pomona College in Claremont, California. He submitted four short stories for a contest in Atlantic Monthly Magazine. I won uh, the first and the third and two honorable mentions. They said, in, in fact, I had, I had won all the top four, but they didn't want to give them all to me because it would look like it was, nobody else was in the contest. You know? 